Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Warrior 3. Today we're going to collect a couple more orbs. Let's start out by uh, talking to this guy. The house ahead is home to a crew of pirates. I'd stay away if I were you. Well, you're not me, so I'm going to explore. Okay, let's go up here and talk to this guy. Arr, who are you? Oh wait, aren't you the, the lot to take on the demon lord? We roam the seven seas. We've heard all about you lot everywhere we go. You're welcome here. Stay as long as you like. Oh, these pirates aren't so bad. You're looking for orbs. I seem to recall seeing something like that in our loot. Where do we put it now? Hmm. <clears throat> okay, let's, uh, let's talk to these sleeping guys over here. A long time ago, we saw a haunted ship wandering the sea. We must have met the ghost ship because we had the bone of a sailor. We gave the bone to the old man in Greenland. Okay, so that, that would give you like a little um, hint for the retrieving the love memory thing. Okay, um, let's talk to these guys. You'd think he'd be a bit more generous in his offers. Yes, what we have we stole, but just seven gold for a copper sword? Ridiculous. Don't disturb us, please. We're discussing business now. Alright. Well, let's talk to this guy over here. From Alihan, are you? I've been there several times. It's a real nice place. Yep. We come from there. Okay, uh, let's talk to this guy. We only rob the evil rich. You can think of us as heroes. They're sort of like Robin Hood, I guess. Hmm. Well, let's, let's, uh, let's see what's in these pots and barrels. Found a token. Okay. And nothing. Another token. Nothing. Tiny metal? Okay. Nothing. Okay. Uh, let's talk to this guy up here. This is our captain's quarters. Oh, I like that little uh, decoration right there. Oh, we got some tube sacks. They're actually a pretty good accessory, but uh, I'm not going to use them. Do you think it's funny that a woman it like commands like you think it's funny that a woman like me commands a crew of pirates? It, okay, right here choose yes. Well, aren't you blunt? I like that. Do you know the island of Wuzami? It's a little it's a little south then a bit west from here. I doubt anyone other than S would even know about it. By the way, are you are you lot really on a quest to defeat the demon lord? Yes. Yeah, you really are? I'm not sure if you can do it, but if you do, come see us. <clears throat> now, I don't know if they actually do anything after you beat the demon lord. If you're saying that, I, like assuming that I am going to beat the demon lord, if you come back here, I don't, I don't think anything happens, but we'll see. Okay, um, that's about all we can do here, I think. So let's uh, let's go outside. This looks like we've run into a little dead end here. Now uh, they have the orb, obviously, since we played the Echoing Flute earlier in the last episode. So it's gotta be here somewhere. Now this is where the tricky part comes in. You gotta, you gotta go up here. You'd think this would be out of time. You go up, go, go up here, but if you go up here, you'll find this boulder. And you think that you have to move the boulder somewhere, but really, oh, you do have to move it, but just move it up, and then that's all you gotta do with the boulder, and then. Remember where the boulder was before you moved it. Search the ground. Oops, wrong button. And a secret passage will open up. Now I'll go down the stairs. And you'll find there, there are all little treasure vaults. Let's see what's in here. Strength seed? Okay. And a punk accessory. I'm not going to use it. So let's do this in this final chest here. Yay, we found the red orb. Perfect. <clears throat> I think we have uh, three orbs now. We just need uh, we need three more. Okay, now let's get out of here. Um, now the next place we're gonna go is um. Well, first let's let's uh, head over to that one island that that person was talking about, Luzami Island. It's all the way down here. It's that little dot right there to the south southwest. We're gonna sail there right now. Oh, right, this is a new enemy here. Uh, I forgot to show these guys off um, on the the ghost ship. I think they were there, but I skipped it by accident. Like I, I skipped the battle by accident. But anyway, uh, these are the tentacles. Uh, no, they're not from any hentai porn or anything. But <laughs> tentacles. Okay, I'll uh, just take them out. No real strategy. For, well, you know, I, I really don't. I'm not too big on strategies, you know, like, 
you know that already. But anyway, let's just take him out. My 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 little model right there. Take him out. We got a quick hit. That's all there is to it. Okay, let's keep sailing here. Y you don't actually have to go here. I don't think this this place. I think this place plays a a little bit of a major role later in the game. Not sure, but um. Um, th there's a couple of good items here you can get. This is Luzami, the Forgotten Island. It's been years since the last time a traveler came before you. Okay, um, actually, you know, I think there, there might be a tiny metal hidden here somewhere. Let's, uh, let's search really quickly. I remember reading something about that. Let's speed it up a little bit. Alright, um, I'll search one more place here really quickly. Uh, no, okay, it's not here. I know there's a tiny metal hidden somewhere on the floor or somewhere, but... Anyway, let's, uh, let's go up here, talk to this guy. I'm glad you visited, but I unfortunately have nothing to sell. Ah, oh, I'll sell you a rumor I heard. The guy I saw belonged to Simon. How much? No charge. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much giving you another hint about, um, that one quest I was doing earlier. Let's search this gravestone for a luck seed. Okay. And let's go in here. <clears throat> and talk to this old man. I see the future. I've waited a long time for you. The Demon Lord's temple is deep in the mountains of Gondo. You shall hurl the Gaia Sword into a volcano and a new path will reveal itself to you. Okay, we'll remember that for later. And let's search these bookshelves for some books. Okay, um, that's all I gotta do there. Let's get out of here now. And there's one more place we can go here. This little house here. Let's talk to this guy. Oops, my bad. The ground under our feet is really round, and it's always spinning around. Because the ground is spinning, the stars and the sun appear to move. But no one would believe me, and I was banished to this island. But even now, the ground is spinning round and round. And furthermore, it's round. Yeah. Pretty much, that guy uh, is explaining that the Earth is not flat like people in the old days used to think. It's round, and he's right. So um, that's about all we can do here. Uh, I'm gonna take a second to try to find that tiny metal off screen really quickly. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Uh, I found the tiny metal. It's the very center of this little f um, brick floor piece here. So yeah, it's a little. It, it, I thought it was somewhere else, but I didn't notice this little place earlier, but yeah. So we found it, so let's get out of here now. And um, I'm going to meet you back at uh, Lancel. Alright, here we are. Um, let's see how I'm doing on health right now. Um, yeah, I gotta stay at the end really quickly before we do anything here. Alright, um, now remember there was a, a little place that was blocked off earlier last time we were here, and I couldn't get through it because I didn't have the final key? Well, now we can get through there. And let's go in here. Um, let's talk to this guy. The yellow orb is said to pass between people all over the all around the world. Even if you had the echo flute, it would be difficult to find. Let's remember that for later. Okay, um, let's go up here now to these jail doors. And I'm gonna change my lineup really quickly. From now on, I'm gonna have Maz in the front. Cause she's she's pretty strong now. Um, she's not the strongest, um, but she does have a better defense power than Adan. So I'm gonna keep her in front. And look, she looks cooler in front anyway. But I did that specifically for this part. Let's talk to this priest. Good of you to come, Maz. Your courage is put to test at this temple. Do you have the courage to fight even alone? Yes. Then come with me. Now, if I would have brought a Don with me right now, that would have been really bad. Because I'm going to need a lot of MP for this place. Then go, Maz. Okay, this is this place that I'm going to is referred to as the Navel of the Earth. And it's not that hard of a place, but it is pretty tricky. And luckily, I went through this, I went through this part on my own before recording. Because it is filled with a lot of um, puzzles and... Not, not really puzzles, but... A lot, a lot of mazes, you know, there's a lot of loops and never-ending hallways, but...
Luckily, the enemies are really weak. They're actually like near the beginning of the game enemies, I think. Some of them are. So it's not gonna be that difficult, but you still wanna have you still wanna have enough MP to survive. Now this room is really tricky because it's so big that you know you, you gotta find another staircase in here, but all you gotta do is go um, north northeast diagonally. Just keep going diagonally to the northeast. And you'll eventually find a staircase. I think it's up here somewhere. No. Yeah. And here it is. Now this part's a bit tricky here. Um, you got there's a fork in the road, and you got to go this way. And you'll run into these little faces. They tell you to turn around. Just don't listen to them. For your own good, turn around. Nope. There actually are pretty hard enemies here. Turn around. But luckily I'm really overpowered right now so I can take care of them easily. And we made it to the middle. This is where we want to be. And I got a tiny metal here. Good stuff. And this chest contains the blue orb. So that's what we came here for. So now let's cast outside. And let's head back to Lancel. You had us worried. Glad you're safe. Shh, be quiet, please. Anyway, good to see you back safely. Weren't you lonely? Um, yes. I see, you're strong. Then were, were you brave? Wait, you should know the answer. Now go on. Alright, mission accomplished. Alright, let's get out of here now. Alright, well that's about all the time I have left for this episode of Let's Play Dragon Warrior 3. When we come back, we're gonna take care of some business with uh, an old friend. But until then, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.